That is just a glimpse of what you will experience from the production of Come From Away tonight and tomorrow over at Hammond's Hall. And with us now is Addison, who stars as Beverly Bass and some other characters as well. So Addison, thank you so much for coming in studio. How are you? Thank you for having me. I always love watching that. It always makes me a little Yeah, I, just, I know. We don't get to see it very often. Yes, it's yeah. usually on promo for other events. So. Yeah. Well, this show is incredibly special. We were talking in the green room before the show today. Um, it's incredibly special. It's based off true events. So for people that are maybe not familiar yet with Come From Away, tell me kind of the backstory on the show. Well, it's always known as the musical about 9-11. Yeah. And I think people in me are immediately like, why would I go see a musical about such a tragic yeah. event? But it's actually so uplifting and heartwarming. And it's a story of how 38 planes emergency landed on 9-11 in Gander, Newfoundland, which is a tiny town in Canada. And it doubled population overnight. Yeah. And they had wow. to find housing and transportation and food for all of these people that had to emergency land there. Mm -hmm. And I think overall the story is not only uplifting and heartwarming, heart warming, but it leaves you feeling restored mm -hmm. and there's like a restoration of hope in the goodness of humanity. Yeah, which I think is incredibly important, especially for this tragedy that a lot of us kind of remember, yeah. you know, here in America. So um, we'll get to that in a, in a little bit, but I am <laughs> curious. So you do play Beverly Bass in this, who is a real life American pilot who was kind of involved in this whole situation. Yeah. So what is it like kind of embodying her in each show? Yeah, I always say this has been the most challenging okay. acting experience I've ever had because in past productions that I've been in, it's fictional people. People, and I've got to make up the emotions and the characteristics about those people. But Beverly Bass is very much still with us. Yeah. And this whole story is based off real events and a real person. And she's actually coming to the show tomorrow. Oh so my we gosh. can touch That's on that later. Wow. Yeah. Um, I've had the opportunity of meeting her um, via Zoom and in person. And she's just as lovely as you would think. Mm -hmm. um, she really had to fight her way in this mm -hmm. time to be the first American Airlines female pilot. And I just think there's a story in itself there. Yeah. And she she gives a different perspective of the events of that day. You know, I think a lot of people that um, the story embodies were having a good time mm -hmm. and enjoying the Newfoundlanders and all of that, but she has a different perspective because it, it was a lot of pressure on those yeah. pilots. They were in meetings constantly, like, how can we get out of here? When can we get back? And then the safety, like, she like the pilots went down with those planes yeah. and I'm sure like there are all those kinds of emotions that she was going through that day so I don't know she's just a powerhouse and she's just as lovely as ever so I really really enjoy playing someone just as awesome yeah yeah absolutely Go in ahead. terms of prep obviously even like acting and yeah. playing her what did that look like for you so we watched endless documentaries on her um, and I just whatever whenever she's interviewed she always is very warming and mm. um, I just wanted to make sure I was portraying that side of her as well because she can still be feminine even though she's in this like mm -hmm. you know right. man powered position so I always wanted to capture that element and also like she always stood her ground and I think that's something you see within her whenever she's talking to the crowd and to the people she's very matter of fact and this mm -hmm. is that but she was also dealing with her own emotions like her husband was yeah. at home her kids were at home she didn't know if they were okay you know yeah. so she's battling a mother and a wife and also being a leader yeah. so I think just making sure I, I touch on all of those things sure. was really really cool yeah. Yeah. Now, to extend on that a little bit, how would you say maybe within playing this role that you've grown as maybe a person or an actor? Like, what are you kind of taking away from Beverly, I guess? Yeah, you know, it's funny. When we when I first got cast as this, I was playing Velma Von Tussle in Hairspray. Wow, which is here opposite. Like, yeah, 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 that's pretty so crazy. So now I, I switched gears in every sort yeah. of the way. And at first I was like, ah, I don't this is gonna be hard. Yeah. I didn't know how hard. And I remember I get to sing this beautiful song called Me in the Sky. And I remember looking at our director and being like, when does this get easier? When mm -hmm. am I, I've, I've sung on stages thousands of times in mm -hmm. my life, but for some reason, when it gets to my song, I get so scared and it's because it's so vulnerable. And mm -hmm. I think That's I relate good. to the story because I've had to work, I mean, not in the same capacity as sure. Beverly Bass, but I've had to work just as hard in my field and in my profession to get where I am today. So mm -hmm. I think once I did some self-diving and like self-evaluating and like found the similarities between mm -hmm. me and her, it made it easier and it, it made it more relatable. Yeah. yeah. I'm able to, you know, tell my story Absolutely. in a way. Absolutely, yeah, that's really cool. Now I know this story we've talked about, it's beautiful, it's inspiring. Yeah. There's a lot of emotions you're probably gonna feel from it. And I know it's kind of like the story of adversity. So how do you think all of that is gonna maybe resonate with the audience? I always say, the moment, just when you want to cry, we're going to hit you with the joke, oh. and you're going to, so oh. you leave laughing, you'll cry, you're, you're going to want more. Mm -hmm. um, it does run an hour and 42 minutes, so there's mm -hmm. no intermission, and we did that, or we, I say we, the production team did that because they want the audience to feel on edge just as the people in Gander felt that day, because yeah. like, again, they had like 
four hours notice before mm -hmm. all these planes started getting diverted and landing there of figuring out where they were going to go. People started opening up their homes. They mm -hmm. turned schools into hostels and people were just constantly making casseroles, yeah. you know, and things like that. So that's something I also can relate to just the, I grew up in Alabama sure. and so Southern hospitality, yeah. I yeah. feel like they see that with the people of Gander as well. And the few people that we've been able to meet, they are just as lovely. And of course you'd want to go home with them because sure. they're just so nice, yeah. you know? Um, so yeah, I just think it, it's, people are going to leave feeling good mm -hmm. and hopeful and we often find that people that come on a Friday night immediately come back the next Ooh, day or like amazing. later it's in the weekend. Yeah, yes. honestly, probably. And, I mean, my parents, I think I've seen it 15 times. Yeah. That's awesome. They see every time they've come, they're like, oh, we didn't notice that last time yes. or we didn't. So, because like you've said, we all take on different characters. Yeah. So I primarily play Beverly Bass, but I also play this woman named Annette, who's the gander version of me. Yeah. And um, she's a school teacher in the area. And so we're always like constantly changing yeah. costume pieces or accents yes. or things like that. So I always am like, okay, when I have the pilot's coat on, I'm obviously the pilot. Sure. When I have the vest on, I'm a gander. When I no vest, I'm yeah. the random right. person. Yeah. You know, so we're like, you have to really like follow us along yes. to Lots of exciting pace. roles, yes. Mm -hmm. I'm so excited for this show. I think our viewers will as well. Yeah. Um, come from away tonight, tomorrow over at Hammonds Hall. You can get your tickets at HammondsHall.com. Addison, thanks so much for being here. Of course, here. thank really you for really having really me. Hope yes. you enjoy the show. Yes.